journalist for Center for Media and Democracy. I'm spending a lot of time in Africa because it's the most best, important, incredible place, especially for solving the climate problem. Farms cannot make food, there are no fish, it's too hot. We're gonna go from there to a fantastic climate where everything is actually healthy and we're gonna have a good life. And why? Africa will solve the problems. Thank you so much, uh, Alex. What uh, is Africa Climate Ban Campaign and why? It's the song. We have a song that's like, we are the world, we are the children, except it's Africa will be the leader of the climate solution. Stars of Africa, each singing one line. Africa is the perfect place, perfect situation right now to solve the problems. And our campaign is putting those solutions out there, these solutions which have to do with the ocean. It has to do with natural photosynthesis from the plankton in the ocean takes the CO2 out of the atmosphere, which is the key point for having a solution. You can't solve this thing without taking CO2 out of the atmosphere. It's impossible. But the good news, it's very possible right here in Africa. And what I'm talking about is natural. It's what happens in the ocean with, with plankton and photosynthesis Within one year, you're taking so much CO2 out of the atmosphere, making a big difference in the heating of the planet. And very important, at the same time, acid is killing the fish. It's killing our oceans. And the only thing with the power to take that acid away is plankton. Plankton power takes the CO2 out of the air and it takes the acid away from being acid, those molecules, and it becomes a healthy ocean. This happens very quickly. I think the most important thing is to deal with the plantain. We'll be able to resolve this climate issue. And we need to go out on boats and put tiny amounts of this nutritional dust 
back in these, what we call the eddies, this is the ecosystems of plankton and underwater life, that quickly brings that plankton back and that's what has the power, the power of plankton. If we're nice to the plankton, they're nice to us and they take that CO2 out very fast in huge numbers, take the acid down, the fish come back and within a short amount of time, we have a, a good climate again. It's that powerful. How we can change the narrative. Africa is victim to Africa will be the leader. N victim is the history, but today it's leader. It's happening right here. Africa is where it's gonna happen. And it's exciting. So the music is all contributing to that, playing with Lipstick Queen and King Sabata. This is perfect way to start the movement and the campaign for Africa to be the leader to get to this reality of leader, we're already there. I can tell you right now that USA and Europe, China, India, they're, they're not leading anything. Africa is already doing the solutions, so they're already the leader, and we're just pushing it more, more, more. But Africa's already the leader, and it's great. Thank it's, you, Africa yeah. is already the leader. And the message is gonna be, hey, USA, hey, Europe, hey, China, guess who is solving the problem? Africa. And that's gonna be reaching the audience right there. My name is Godfrey, but I'm popularly known as King Subada. We, we, we don't have time already. Either we act now or we all perish. It's action now. Action now, climate action now. Action now, the better time is now. Tomorrow is far for us. Today with climate change, for a better tomorrow, let's act today. Action now, let's take action now. Action now, climate action now. Action now. King Sabata, he's unbelievable. Music is the bottom line to draw a lot of people's attention to whatever we are campaigning about. Yes, it's the most important, but music, can we say that music is the best way? Yes, I'll say that music is the best way because which other way other than music? To get a message across to somebody, put it in music and it's, it sticks to the person's mind forever because they, they will sing it all the time. And then that would inform them that, oh, yeah, that's true, you know? And the more we sing it, the message goes further than just standing somewhere and talking about it and forgotten about. So your mind is alive. 